Hey everybody, Steph here and today we're going to show you another lovely pen and what we have here as it says on the box is a Visconti fountain pen. Now if we take the outer box which, well, a little bit on the tatty side but it's, uh, it's there. As you can see the pen comes in this lovely leather like case and if we open the pen, wow wee, there we go, an absolutely gorgeous Visconti fountain pen. What we have here is the Visconti Kaleido Voyager fountain pen. It comes in the original case. It comes with the original um, instructions and guarantee. There's a, a Visconti sticker there. It looks like it's got the original pen sticker that somebody's popped in onto the case inside there. So let's take the pen out, close the case up and pop that to one side. And what we have here is an absolutely stunning, as I say, the Visconti Kaleido Voyager fountain pen. Now, this particular pen, the colour of it is what they term as Yellow Dawn. Now, why they call it Yellow Dawn, I'm, Dawn should I say, I'm not too sure, but it's got these absolutely beautiful sort of brown, well, yeah, I suppose yellow swirls in the pattern absolutely lovely okay so as I say this is called the Yellow Dawn when they actually brought this particular pen out I believe around about 1999 I believe they brought them out in other colours as well um, one being the termed as the um, Eclipse Grey there was a Rainforest Green um, I think there was a is it Typhoon Blue and a I think there was a sunset red as well. So they came in numerous different colours and well I think they brought out a black one as well. But this one as I say is the, the Yellow Dawn. Absolutely stunning. The size of the pen from the top of the cap to the bottom here um, is approximately 145 millimetres. Around the barrel it's quite a substantial 14 millimetres in diameter. And if we go up to the to the cap here and show you the clip. Now you'll see the clip's got this very nice ornate gold plated, well the, the trim I believe is gold plated, the, the band and the clip, um, but the clip, the sorry, the band has got this ornate band here with, with it's got like what the, well it looks like V's cut into the band. Let's give you a little bit of a close up there so you can see it. And if we actually turn it round to the back there, you can see it's got Visconti Forenzi on the back of the the cap band there. Let's show you the clip there. A rather unusual clip. Again gold plated I believe. And I believe this, this particular clip actually represents um, a boat from the 1992 America's Cup. Um, the Moro D. is it Venez Venezia? Excuse me if my pronunciation isn't isn't correct, but it represents that particular boat on a wave, I believe. But there's the clip, and as you can see, it's actually a spring-loaded clip like so. So it makes it very easy to pop into into your jacket pocket, into your shirt, whatever. Quite ingenious, I think. Now, if we go to the top of the the cap, there you can see it's got this silver stud. And it's actually to the top there, it says Visconti Voyager. And if we take you down to the bottom of the barrel, it's also got a small stud in silver there to complement it. So, all in all, a very, very nice pen. Although saying that, I'm a vintage fountain pen man, and I, I came across, I've got numerous quite, what I term as quite new new pens I mean although this is 1999 I still term it as quite new so I've got a number of pens that I'll be showing you that well I'll be looking for new homes as well for but all in all I must say even though it's not my cup of tea an absolutely stunning fountain pen now if we take the cap off which unscrews and let's show you the the pen and the cap together like so. Let's give it a few twirls so you can see different angles. Absolutely lovely. Let's take you to the top there. You can see it's got the 
the section to the top there which is slightly tapered towards the nib and if we show you the nib a lovely nib I must say so I'm quite impressed with this particular nib um, what you've got here is the Visconti 18 carat 750 Firenze medium nib let's try and keep it nice and still so you can see it um, one of the other things I've actually read I mean again I don't know how true it is because it you know these pens are not not my cup of tea but as you can see to the side of the pen all uh, sorry to the side of the nib all the way up it's got this gold gold trim if you like so I believe that they, they did actually two nibs I believe this is actually maybe the the earlier nib because on the later ones I believe the the gold plate was just simply towards the tines at the top there but all in all an absolutely gorgeous nib and as you can see it's a medium medium nib if we turn it round for you and show you the feed there okay you can see it's got this sort of combed feed to the back and let's show you a sideways view like so all in all very very nice if we take the barrel off and unscrew it unfortunately on this particular pen there's no filler inside okay it just comes with the section and the barrel like so and you can see it's got this brass section to the bottom there I believe these particular pens you can actually take they will actually take cartridges um, which are readily available and I believe and I'll stand corrected if I'm wrong um, they, they'll also accept uh, Visconti um, ink converters as well so unfortunately I can't actually show you the pen writing because it's got no no converter or anything but actually what I'll actually do because I know I know you people like to see the pens writing and to be quite honest with you I'd like to well let's just see what how it actually writes so what I'm actually going to do I'm just going to simply I'm going to simply dip the pen in ink so let's have a look at how it writes so so what we've got is a vis a Visconti Kaleido and this is the Voyager okay so you have to excuse the skipping all I'm doing is just to the side of the camera I'm just uh, dipping it in the ink and what we have the colour of this particular one is yellow dawn all in all a very very nice writer nice and smooth there's no variation in the in the writing so as it says on the nib it's a medium nib but writes very very nicely very smooth I'm actually quite impressed okay again excuse that little bit of skipping because all we're doing is just simply we've just simply dip the pen so let's show you a writing sample very very nice if I may say so myself so there we have it there's a writing sample for you let's put the cap back on so all in all an absolutely gorgeous pen although as I say this particular pen is too new for me but I'm sure somebody would appreciate it so what we have is a stunning Visconti Kaleido Voyager and the colour as we said before is this beautiful yellow dawn so let's pop the pen back down like so I hope you've enjoyed looking at the pen as much as I've enjoyed showing it to you don't forget there's lots and lots of videos on my channel go and have a look at them and don't be shy leave a comment but for now I'm just going to simply say bye bye now